Just for a warm up, I'm going to do a trick here. You're doing nothing, can you? Oh, I'm sorry. I won't be up here. Uh, this is the thing I do all the time. Now, this today is closures. You know, uh, I don't work that way at all. I have a completely different system working close up the table, uh, which we'll have time I'll talk about later. Uh, but uh, one of the tricks I, I will go back and do sometimes is this thing I've got to do now, which she's got 52 cards, and if you look at my face, which is not a pretty sight, you'll realize I'm not even looking at the cards while they're going to stop these tricks up you've ever seen in your life. Sure. We've got a bit before, so haven't we? Say no, no. if you've got to. That's no. it. Well, what I want you to do is very simple. I'm going to give you the cards. I've got a, you ever heard of Old Moor? No, Old Moor wrote an almanac in, in England, Ireland. 1697, and then they allocated a playing card to every day of the year. 1697. So if I give you the card, will you deal them off the top of the deck like that? Yes. Face up. And as you do so, you go January, February, March, April, May, June, July. Stop on a month you go home. Okay. And I don't know what you do. No. When you've done that, then you go one, two, three, four, five, six. Stop on the deck you go home. All right? And there, yeah, go for it. Okay. That's your time. Uh, this is the kind of thing that, I, first time I did this, a few years back, sat down at the table with four women and I had to do the trick four times. And I swear to God, the same restaurant, the following week, I sat down at the table with nine women and I had to do the trick six times. Is that it? That's it. You finish up at 10 o'clock, do you know what that means? No. God. That means that in about 10 to 14 days time, you're going to meet a young man. <laughs> Handsome. Oh, no, no, there's no romance, it's strictly business. It's going to do a little business transaction, and, and the good thing about it is it's going to be ongoing, you know, which means in a couple of weeks' time you're going to start making some money. You don't believe what I'm saying? No. No, no. no one ever does. No one ever does. No. But wouldn't it be interesting if that card, the Ten of Clubs, was the very card that Old Moor allocated to you, Wednesday? That would be awesome. In 1697? Yes. Yeah. Well, there's a copy of Old Moore's Diary. So will you have a look inside the diary at your birthday okay. and see which playing <coughs> card Old Moore allocated to your birthday in 1697? Nine. It's the ten of clubs. Ten of clubs. And you got the ten of clubs. <laughs> yeah. 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 Just for the record, it's entirely self-working. Uh, whatever, whatever, you can get, uh, repeat it immediately with anyone, they deal with their birthday, uh, and that's the card that turns up in the diary. If you do it for women, do the little fortune telling bit in the middle, and they will want you to keep doing it all over the bloody room for them. And it's, I don't use it as a sort of closing trick, but sometimes, depending on the situation, I'll go back and do it, and then that's when you pick up the other work.